Oh, uh. Hi everyone, in this video I am going to drink a cola. Ah. And then I'm going to review, unbox and review the UDIRC 1602 or UDRC 1602 Pro brushless speed. The UDIRC 1602 comes in a cool looking box which appears to have been opened before. At first we got the manual which you should read. All the spare parts are listed which is useful when you need to fix something. Here we have the car itself and it looks fantastic. Time to take out my trusty little pocket knife. Next is the radio control which appears to have a solid build. On it you have settings for steering, throttle and the ESP or gyro which I will test later on. One handed driving will be difficult though. And then we have a charger, tiny screwdriver, some wrenching tool, allen key, spare steering links and body clips. I forgot to mention that it comes with two sets of tires, rubber tires and those clicky plastic drift tires. The gyro on this RC doesn't seem to do a good job. Turned off, the car will drive relatively normal and stable. Turned halfway up, the car starts to wobble around. Now with the gyro halfway up. With the gyro all the way up, it's difficult and awkward looking. <laughs> On your radio control you have a button to switch between the different light modes. They look absolutely awesome. Let's jump into the next scene for some drifting. Splashing through puddles is a guilt-free pleasure thanks to the waterproof electronics.
Now let's slap on those plastic tires for some more drifting. Panther, asphalt and legend, super sport, ready to run, high speed racing. I do admire the muscle car design, I really do. Don't really know what happened, but I love steering. <laughs> okay. <laughs> ah! Some piece of acorn got stuck between the servo, the servo arms. Yeah, let's shake this thing out of there. Ah! Okay. That should work again. Perfect. All in all, I had so much fun with this RC and I cannot wait to upgrade those dampers because those friction dampers were very bouncy. Thank you for watching and please like and subscribe.